Post fight to Julio Cesar Chavez Jr. versus Brian Vera. He came fight news here. And you know what? Julio Cesar Chavez Jr. looks bad once again. As, uh, you know, he just could not look good in this fight. Um, we saw a completely different Chavez from the one who fought Martinez. It, it was a complete opposite of um, what we've seen from Chavez at his best, which is a come forward. Uh, stalker who rips body shots and puts ultimate pressure on his opponents uh, against Martinez he was the truth test in this fight he was the boxer he, he boxed off his back foot he was throwing counter right hands uh, one shot at a time he was the counter puncher in this fight that rarely took the lead and Brian Vera was the aggressor could you imagine that? Brian Vera was the aggressor against Chavez Jr., outworking him, throwing a greater volume of punches, completely outlanding him. Uh, I think he threw something like 700-something uh, punches and landed like 398, where Chavez landed 180-something. And they gave it to Chavez Jr. by wide margins. Only one judge had a 96-94. I thought that would be a consensus type uh, verdict, but the other two judges had it like 97, 92, and it's ridiculous, ridiculous uh, verdict. Fucking California judges. The worst part is the only reason that judge left C.J. Ross is because it was on a it was on the biggest card of boxing. Uh, it was the biggest event of boxing. These judges ain't shit gonna happen to them. That's the worst fucking part. Because, my God, I agree 100% with the way Steve Weisfeld saw it. I saw Brian Vera completely outworking him, uh, even landing very hard shots at times, uh, like this straight right hand that Chavez Jr. just could not avoid. Um, and he was even slipping shots. Uh, but what was even more evident was uh, the close back and forth action through the first six rounds. And then the trend where Chavez had a few rounds, but then Brian Vera took over in the 8th, ninth, and 10th rounds. I saw him sweeping the, the quote-unquote championship rounds in a 10-round fight. I saw him sweeping. And uh, that really showed you uh, the lack of conditioning Chavez was in. Uh, in my opinion, I had a feeling this kind of shit would happen. Fucking Chavez Jr. Uh, I had a fucking feeling because, you know, we, we know they want to set up a, a mega fight with him and Andre Ward. We know that for a fact. Andre Ward has to get past Edwin Rodriguez. And for sure, they're going to put this fight together. But what the fuck, man? Chavez Jr. did not deserve a victory. He just did not deserved to win this fight in terms of how he came out there throwing one shot at a time he did land like 50 percent of his punches but his output was vastly lower compared to uh, Brian Vera's and while he did show some skill uh, a, a lot of sh sh what Chavez was doing uh, in the later rounds was com complaining to the ref however there were Numerous low blows by uh, Brian Vera. I saw I saw a few, but uh, nothing to take a point away, except the the referee just wasn't, you know, giving uh, Chavez any any credit for uh, uh, the fouling of of Brian Vera. But nevertheless, that does not take away from Brian Vera outworking Chavez, outboxing Chavez. And making Chavez look completely ordinary against a limited flat-footed fighter like Brian Vera, who showed some foot movement, who showed some defense, and even that gave Chavez problems. You know, and he showed, uh, you know, he just showed he was uh, he was in completely better condition, better shape, the better athlete, while Chavez just looked slow, sloppy. Uh, landing very hard shots and 
it seemed like that's what the judges uh, was looking for, is one or two hard shots from Chavez Jr. that stole rounds. But I think that was a ridiculous decision. And I'll be honest, uh, I didn't lose money on this fight because I, I, I put some coin on Chavez by decision. But if fucking Vera pulled this shit out, I would have won a hell of a lot of money. So, so in that situation, I'm fucking disgusted right now. Um, so you call me biased. That's what it is. I, I think Vera won this fight. Similar to how Steve Weisfeld saw the fight, I, I agree with him. And so overall, let me know what you guys think. I thought Brian Vera did enough uh, to pull this fight out because of the work he put in in the later rounds. And if you guys disagree, let me know what rounds you thought Chavez won. How did you score it? Let me know. We can fight news. Peace out, guys.